What's good? What's up, brother? How you doing? What's How your name? You? Huh? What's your name? Cameron. Cameron Wahab. Nice to meet you, brother. Nice to meet you, bro. Yeah. I'll love to offer you a book if that's okay. It's okay. It's completely free, my dear brother. If that's okay with you. Uh, sure. Yeah, okay, no absolutely. Problem. Okay, beautiful, man. So this is a holy. Uh, this is called the glorious Quran, right? Mm -hmm. uh, we believe this is the final testament from the Almighty, Most Merciful Creator, right? That came to the final prophet of God, right? Gotcha. Yeah. Um. Do you want me to share a little bit about Islam with you, if, if you have a minute? Uh, I don't have a minute. I'll take the the book, though. Okay. You know, sounds I like good. I like learning about all religions and absolutely. stuff like that. I'm a Jewish studies major. Okay, beautiful, beautiful, so, beautiful. Yeah, thank yeah. you. What's your name again? My name is Wahab. Abdul uh, Wahab, yes, sir. It's right. a pleasure meeting you. Pleasure meeting you. And if you have any questions, feel free to ask, okay, my awesome. dear brother? Thank you. Bro. Yeah. I appreciate you coming up, by the way. Thank you. I'm Absolutely. wearing, uh, I don't know, what, what do you guys usually call it? Per uh, uh, per yeah. Yes. Per yeah. So, yeah. kind of. Sure. Do you have like a, a name in uh, Arabic for it? Well, I'm not Arab, Arab so I, I honestly, yeah, I don't know what the, I think maybe Kufi, but I'm not sure if that's the Arab. I don't, I don't know if it's at the Arabic, to be honest, because I'm not Arab, yeah. So, in Quran, isn't that usually... In Arabic, Arabic yes, 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 yes. So that's connected to Muslims, right? Yes, yes. So, I thought that Muslims are Arab, no? No, 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 only 9% of Muslims are Arab. So, where, what is the majority, majority of Muslims are actually Asian. Asian? Yeah, yeah. Uh, India, I think. Uh, no, like, I think the uh, like Indonesia, Malaysia, these are all Muslim countries. Yeah, that's actually one of the big, uh, big misconceptions that this is an Arab religion. Only nine percent of Arabs are actually Muslim. Wow. Yeah. 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 Wow, very interesting. Yeah. And then what are you guys doing? This is MSA, so Muslim Student Muslim. Association. Yes, sir, yes, sir. I had it on my community college, so I got to know a bunch of people. So okay, beautiful. Very interesting. Yeah. Have you ever had an opportunity to read the Quran by chance? Uh, I studied a little bit of it. Okay. During one of my summers, I was like interested. I was taking a religious-based class, so beautiful. I was like, right, I'm going to study a little bit, see what it's about, write a little bit of the Bible also. <laughs> Obviously, the Old Testament is what Of course, of course, of course, of course. But it's very interesting. It's like very connected. I find it it's all connected, bro. It's all connected. Yeah, a lot yes. More connected to Judaism than Christianity. Is. Absolutely. So you guys are a lot more uh, connected to us than you guys were Christianity because yeah. you guys are allowed to pray in the masjid, but you guys are not allowed to pray in the church. Exactly. Yeah. 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 I've been into uh, when I was in the Middle East. I went inside a, uh, a mosque once. It's like very similar. It's really interesting. Mm -hmm. I don't know. I thought I'd stop by and say hello. Absolutely. No, I appreciate that, man. It yeah. means a lot. Yeah, absolutely. And you know, a lot of people have a lot of misconceptions that Muslims and Jews can't get along. You know, I believe all that comes out from the media. Because yeah. look at us right now, you know. Along, uh, right? Yeah, absolutely. There's no reason. Yeah, absolutely. You yeah. know, we all believe in one God. We all worship one God. That's all that matters. Yeah, yeah. absolutely. Well, nice meeting you. Absolutely. It was a pleasure talking to you as well. Okay? See you around absolutely. Time. Absolutely. I look forward to it. All right, brother? Take care. Tim. Tim, nice okay, pleasure to meet you. I'll love to offer you guys some free book if free books if that's okay with you guys. The good word? Yeah, absolutely, my dear brother. Yeah, yeah. Hmm. Let me think about it. Okay, no problem, no problem. I'm already Muslim. Okay, beautiful, beautiful. Yeah, do, do you mind if I share with you a little bit about Islam? I mean, if you have any questions, feel free to ask. There's no such thing as a bad question. Sure, go ahead. Okay, beautiful. So Islam simply means submission to Almighty God, right? Uh -huh. A Muslim means a person who chooses to submit their will to Almighty God, right? Okay. So as Muslims, we have a very simple belief, right? That there's only one great supreme creator, right? Uh -huh. And that creator, only that creator is worthy of worship. That, that creator sent many prophets, many, messenger, uh, mess many messengers, all with the same message, to worship that supreme creator alone, without any partners, without any equals. We believe that the first prophet of God, uh, the first prophet of Islam, actually Islam began with Adam, right? And it came with the last testament, which is Quran. So that's a simple belief of what we believe as Muslims. Do you have any questions? It seemed like you had something to say. You guys must have lots of friends. It sounds uh, pretty similar to several other major religions, huh? Sure, but what makes Islam different than uh, any other religion is we are the only pure monotheistic religion. Every other religion claims to be monotheistic, but they worship other than God as well. They worship God along with other they associate partners with God. One thing that's different about Islam is the only pure monotheistic religion in the world. It's the only religion that worships God and God alone, without any partners, without any equals. Without Can you give an saying, example? Yeah, absolutely. Like, like for Christians, instance, like whether they yeah, they believe they, they believe in the Trinity concept of the Trinity, oh, right? True. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So they they believe Father, Son, Holy Spirit, all co you know, all equal. Right, all one, but there's three parts. Right, mm -hmm. so we do. We believe that Almighty God is indivisible. You cannot divide God into parts. That He's absolutely one. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So that's that would be just a just a quick uh, recap of what Islam teaches. Any questions, my friend? Not me.
Assalamu alaikum. Well, alaikum salam. I would love to offer you a book if that's okay with you. Uh, go ahead and save it. Okay, okay. I don't I want like to take something. Huh? I like your pen. My pen? Yeah, the green one. Which one? Oh, it's a keychain. Yeah, it's a keychain. Yeah, yeah. yeah. As you said the pin. I was like, what? I yeah, yeah. Was, I thought it was pinned on. No, no, no. It's, it's my car keys. Yeah, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. What is that? Uh, oh, this is a uh, Medina, right? So this is the place where the Prophet Muhammad, the final Prophet of Almighty God, was buried. Saudi. Right? In Saudi, yeah. In in Medina, yeah, in Saudi Arabia. Yes. You're uh, Algerian. No, um, my parents are from Pakistan. Yeah, but I was born and raised in Los Angeles. Yes. What about you? What country are you from? Tajikistan. Okay. Nice. Nice. I'm not really familiar with that. It's a Muslim country. Okay, nice, nice. You should be familiar with it. Yeah, yeah, I actually, uh, I just read the Quran for the first time about 10 years ago. I wasn't really religious uh, before. Yeah, so I just, I recently just came back to God. Uh, but before, I wasn't really that religious. Obviously, living in LA, it's very easy to be distracted with all the, you know, desires and the worldly stuff, you know what I mean? So for me, I was very distracted, you know, in my in my younger ages. And then once... You feel more grounded now? I feel, I feel amazing. I feel truly at peace. You know, that's something, you know, that everybody searches for. Even the most successful people in the world, they have all the money, but they don't have peace, right? So that's yeah. something that is Morally completely... Bankrupt. Yeah, absolutely, absolutely, right? So peace is something that is completely priceless, right? And that's something that Islam offers, right? Mm -hmm. Peace. Because you get to know... Because the saying is, right, that how can you be happy if the, the one that created you is not happy with you, right? So Islam teaches you how to get close to your creator, and it tells you who your creator is. And a very clear definition of who your creator is and it's very clear cut like it's it's not like uh there's no confusion you know it's just very clear cut simple message do you guys do a lot of works in the community yes absolutely absolutely yeah yeah you can tell yeah talking to people absolutely, absolutely. spreading the good word absolutely absolutely it's no it's, it's important man it's important to talk to people in a beautiful manner right yeah. and you know obviously there's a lot of misconceptions about islam right and uh, there's reasons for that there's a reason why people have so much misconceptions about islam it's mainly because they want to stop the truth from going out because the reality what islam teaches right are very fundamental things that bring people peace and security into their life for instance there's a reason why they attack islam because if islam does spread throughout the world right guess what the gambling industry will no longer exist right people are not going to lose hundreds of millions of dollars every single year losing their houses losing their families committing suicide the alcohol industry wouldn't exist right um you know the fashion industry with immodest women everywhere is not going to exist right um the banking industry is not going to exist people completely turn into slaves based on their mortgages and all the interest right all that stuff so there's a reason there is actually a political agenda against Islam to stop people from accepting it because people profit off, you know, um, you know, going against it. Interesting. Yeah. So it's just I important. Have a lot of solutions. Absolutely, absolutely, absolutely. That's <laughs> Got why it all figured out. Absolutely, absolutely, my dear brother. Yeah. Yeah, I, I highly encourage you to grab a book, my dear brother. It's actually one of the most read books in the entire world today, right? Actually, the most the most successful businessmen, the most successful CEOs in the world, they all have this book, right, in their library. Really? Because it's not just a book about God. It's uh -huh. a book of knowledge, wisdom. It teaches you how to, how to conduct business, right? It teaches you many, many, many things, right? It's not just about God. So that's a lot of things that well, people don't understand. This is a book true of knowledge and wisdom. And it's an almost 14, 1500 year old book, right? Ancient book, right? That still existed till this time, right? That actually made it till this time. This is actually the original scripture right here, right? My, my. Yeah, this is the original scripture. And then it's translated into English or it's translated to Spanish or it's translated to any other language. What language but is that? Like this is Arabic? Arabic. Yeah, this is Arabic. Yeah, yeah. So okay. this is the original Arabic, yes. And then um, we translate it into uh, English or other, any other language. So let's say if you have a misunderstanding with the English, you could always refer back to the original. And that's something a lot of religions don't have the original copy, right? In yeah. the original language. That's something that's missing from... Been translated a couple times. Absolutely, absolutely. But they don't have the original. You know, they probably have something twice translated, and that's what they have to start off with. Uh -oh. Many opportunities to mistranslate. Huh? Absolutely, absolutely, my dear brother. Yeah. Right. Very nice to meet you. Yeah, absolutely. It was a pleasure, man. Yes, sir, yes, sir. Absolutely, absolutely. Guys, it was a pleasure. Safe? Yes, sir. Take care, guys. Have a good one. Take care. <laughs> 
سَلَهُمْ خَزَنَتُهَا أَلَمْ يَأْتِكُمْ نَذِيرٌ قَالُوا بَلَى قَدْ جَاءَنَا نَذِيرٌ فَكَذَّبَنَا وَكُلْنَا مَا نَزَّلَ اللَّهُ وقلنا ما نزل الله من شيء إن أنتم إلا في ضلال كبير وقالوا لو كنا نسمع أو نعكل ما كنا في أصحاب السعير فاعترفوا بذنبهم فسهقا لأصحاب السعير